Hi, this is Jana with Bees Knees, and today I'm going to be working with TechRap's new Mirror Chrome Bubble Free Vinyl. We're going to be making this cute mug with a conversation heart, but I'm not going to show you how it turns out because I'm excited to try the Bubble Free Claim on the Mirror Chrome and see if it actually lives up to the hype. So you'll have to wait till later to see how it turns out. But I am going to give you this free Conversation Heart SVG. You can download it at my website or you can find it in the linked in the description below. So let's get started by looking at all the colors that are offered in this lineup. We have purple pink. Purple Magic. Iris Purple, Autumn Copper, Begonia Rose, Wine Red, Camouflage Olive, Military Brown, Lime Green, and Cayenne Orange. So I'm going to give you a closer look at this. This is the Iris Purple. It's super cool. It's very thick and then what's supposed to make a bubble free are these air pockets teeny teeny tiny all over the vinyl and something else that is unique about this vinyl is if you can see you can kind of see through the vinyl and you can see there's a grid on the back and this is cool, kind of translucent. Um, feels almost like um, thick vellum paper. And what's what I love about this is each one of these squares made up of four little squares is an inch. It's a square inch. So you can easily count and cut um, the size that you need to cut out without wasting extra. I always overcut because it's hard to to know exactly, you know, where five inches is, you know, etc. And also these grids help you cut straight lines. So it's the first time I've seen that and that's pretty cool. So excited to see how this works out. And the ultimate test is going to be not just layering this vinyl on something, but layering the vinyl on top of vinyl. That's where I always run into issues. I can never, never, never get it so there's not air bubbles in between two layers of vinyl. So for today's project, I'm going to make something um, where we purposely have to do that so we can test this out and see how it works. So I am so excited. So let's get started. So to cut this, I'm just using the pre regular premium vinyl setting and I'm adding more pressure and I'm using my blue tech wrap mat. So I just cut these out and the colors I'm using are, I went with Begonia Rose for the writing, Iris Purple for the top layer and Purple Magic for the bottom layer. So we are going to see how this weaves. And that weeded out just great, which means it cut just great on the setting I used and it was easy to weed. Perfect. 
So it passed that test. Now the big test. We are first going to apply a layer on the cup and see how that works. We are going to apply a layer on top of another layer, which is what I always have an issue with. So first you want to prep your cup or whatever you are applying your vinyl to with an alcohol wipe. Get that surface nice and clean from dirt, debris, and oil, and then let that dry. And while we let that dry, we are going to take our bottom layer, which is the darker purple magic. And to transfer, I'm going to use TechWrap's matte transfer tape. It is my all time favorite transfer tape out of any that I've ever used. So here is my and I'm not being very careful um, as I lay it down and burnish it. I'm putting it to the test. So there is my bottom layer. And I'm just going to on purpose plop this down on here, not even being careful, not working from side to side. Just plop it down. Normally that would cause me tons of air bubbles. Um, but we will see what happened with this. Aha. So there you go. There is not a single air bubble. It's smooth. It's mirror like glass like it is perfect. So let's get our second layer. And again, I'm not going to be careful. I even just created an air bubble right there. Okay, so this is going to be dangerous. So if you can see that, so I created an air bubble between my transfer tape and my vinyl. And usually when that happens to me, I know it's not going to go well when I put this vinyl on top of other vinyl. So let's see if this technology gets rid of that issue. So I want to line this up. So I'm going to take my parchment paper and I'm going to leave a little bit of this transfer tape hanging over the edge. So when it get when I get it lined up, I can stick it on. Okay, that looks lined up. So I'm going to stick it there. There's my air bubble. And again, I'm not going to be very careful. I'm just going to put this down, rub it on. I still have that air bubble between my transfer tape and my vinyl. So let's see if it's between my two vinyls. Ha, just as I thought, it is not there. It is smooth in mirror. So this is exciting because no more wasted vinyl and wasted time um, messing around with those air bubbles. Okay, the last layer, and I don't expect any issues with this based on what we've seen and the fact that this is very thin um, and it wouldn't normally get air bubbles under it. So the claims are true. It really is air bubble free. I'm really excited about this new product and it's so much fun to work with because it's not frustrating. So hopefully you guys can get your hands on some too and give it a try.